Zoo Montana here in Billings was recently recognized as a top 10 zoo in the entire country. But it wasn't that long ago that the community here nearly lost this zoo in its entirety. And that hard work to getting them to this point is a big reason why the recognition is so special. It's one of the biggest draws to the Magic City. It's something really fun to do when we come to Billings. Zoo Montana, which has been offering visitors the chance to take a walk on the wild side for years. A couple times a month. That's usually on the weekend. Um, try and make one run to town a month to get groceries. Season ticket holder and Red Lodge resident Lee Walker says her family visits the zoo a few times each month, always enthralled with the experience. They have beautiful grounds, great animals, and wonderful playground that's all around. It's a, it's a great place to come and spend the day. A great place to visit, but Walker, who grew up in Billings, says it wasn't always that way. There weren't nearly as many animals um, the, the tigers were always the big draw. A lack of animals, but most importantly, serious budget shortfalls plagued the zoo in its early days, even losing its AZA accreditation. When we took over here at the zoo, things were bad, and I think a lot of people in the community remember that. But in 2011, Jeff Ewalt was named director, and since then, everything has changed. Ewalt has since corrected the ship, becoming more involved in the community and making regular appearances right here on Q2, where he proudly and routinely scared a few anchors. All of that hard work has culminated into Ewalt Zoo, now being a top 10 zoo in the nation according to USA Today. A feat Ewalt doesn't take lightly. I get emotional almost every day about this. When I see this, these kind of news come through and I, I sit back and reflect on some of the things that we have been through to get to this point, yeah, it's absolutely emotional. While Ewalt is proud of the progress, he says they won't get complacent, working with two major goals in mind. We do what we do for really two reasons. One, the animals, obviously that's our number one priority, but the second reason is the community of Billings. In Billings, Charlie Kleps, MTN News.